Now, today, the boys section also we have done electromagnetic waves and the boys also have done a very good uh, model of electromagnetic waves. So these are my students who prepared this model. Uh, can you introduce yourself? Myself, Muhammad Irfan al Khan and I am studying in Hyderabad school. Myself, Faiz Hussain Fahad and I am studying in Hyderabad school. Myself, Muhammad Muzaffar Adin, I am student of Hyderabad school. My name, myself, Muhammad Khalid Dilwari Zamakhan, I am studying in Hyderabad school. My name is Sayyid Sohail I am studying in Hyderabad school. So these all are institute batch and these students have done a very good model. After uh, completing of these electromagnetic waves, they are telling about some basic information of this model. Uh, Irfan, can you tell something about this model? Yes sir. In this model, the x-axis is known as propagation of wave and the y-axis is known as electric field and the z-axis is known as magnetic field. When the electric field will generate, at the same time magnetic field also generates. This is called electromagnetic wave. Very good. Listen, what he told, he told this, the black color is the propagation of waves and when the electric field generates at the same time magnetic field also generates when they start from 0 to 0 0.1 0 0.2 0.3 start the peak point at the same time the magnetic field also start at the peak point so electric field here in the y-axis and magnetic field is here in the z-axis so this total model is known as electromagnetic waves can you say some more points in this model, we have three types of axes. Good. X axis, Y axis, and Z axis. Very nice. This model is known as electromagnetic field. You can see it. The okay. number of fields travel in a unit time it is known as frequency. It is represented by nu. Okay, what he told? He told about the frequency. He told how many number of waves are there. Here, the total number of waves in a particular unit time is known as Frequency. Very good. Can you say some more points about this model? From this peak to this peak is known as crust. From this to this peak is known as also wavelength. From below of this bottom of this peak is known as rough. This is also called as a rough. From third to third is also known as wavelength. Wavelength. Okay, he told that this is the wave top point and this is the wave top point from this top point to top point the length is known as wavelength look at here this peak point is known as crust and the bottom side peak point is known as crust. very good next can you say some more points yes. in this model we have two waves from here to here half from here to here one then here to here uh, one half then here to here two in this model we have total two waves two waves Look at here, total, the last guy told here, total number of waves, how many waves are there? Two, Two, Two waves, waves are yes. So here, the complete model of electromagnetic waves. waves. The propagation of waves, the electric field waves and the magnetic field waves. waves. Electromagnetic waves model, this is the propagation of waves. The propagation of waves is known as x-axis. It representing the x-axis and the y-axis shows the electric field and the z-axis shows the magnetic field. So we can draw on the board only two types of axes that is x-axis and y-axis. But we cannot draw on the board z-axis. So it is better to understand the 3D model. Look at here, how it looking 3D model? Yes. Yeah. This is x-axis and y-axis. Because the board is only two dimension board, so we can draw only two axes, x-axis and y-axis. But we cannot draw out of the board and inside of the board. So for this uh, preparation, this is the preparation of model of electromagnetic phase. By seeing with your eyes, you can understand very well. So our students have done very good job and clap for them. Thank you for this opportunity.